Hey guys, welcome back to Six Sister Stuff. I'm here with my friend Jennifer from a little bit of Calm and Crazy. And today we are shopping at the Dollar Tree to bring you some Mother Day gift basket ideas. So I'm Kristen, I am sister number two from SixSistersStuff.com. And this is Jen from A Little Bit of Calm and Crazy. And we have been friends for a few years now. And today we're gonna share with you some amazing Mother's Day gift baskets. I'm gonna share with you the Busy Mom on a Go gift basket. And I'm gonna share with you my Mommy Survival gift basket. We're here at the Dollar Tree right now. So we're gonna go in, go shopping, then come home and put it all together. So in order to see her gift basket, make sure you go over to a little bit of Calm and Crazy. I'll link it down below in the description. And of course, check out my basket. All right guys, let's head on in and go shopping. Now the first thing you wanna pick up is the container. What is going to hold your gift basket? Now, because mine is Busy Mom on the Go, I want it in the car, so I want it with a lid. Now, they have some other baskets there, but these ones were really flimsy and I didn't love them. Now, the Dollar Tree has a large selection of Band-Aids. You can get some cute ones, or you can get some normal ones. Number three, tissues. Every mom needs tissues in her car. It's just a rule. Now, they have these packs of eight that are perfect for in the car. Number four, floss. Now, hopefully I'm not the only one who needs floss sometimes in the car, especially after I go out for a meal. Number five, lip balm. Now, if she's gonna leave it in the car, make sure you get a kind that has a twisty lid so it won't spill all over your car. Number six, girl stuff. We're just gonna call it girl stuff because we all know we've all been in a situation where we need it. There you go. Number seven, medicine. I love to keep little bottles of Advil and Tylenol. And at the Dollar Tree, they come in those little bottles. The good thing is you can refill those. Number eight, now being a mom of four, I know how important hand sanitizer is, especially in public restrooms when they don't have any soap. The Dollar Tree has these travel jars right now where they have screw on lids, which is perfect for safety pins, for little snacks, whatever they want to use them for. Number 10, hand lotion. Now growing up, my mom always had hand lotion in the car. They have all kinds of name brands, including Jurgens there too. Number 11, hair elastics. Now I can't tell you how many times I went to soccer and didn't have a hair elastic to pull my hair up. So now I keep some in my car. So they're going in my basket. Number 12, scissors. Now I've had a lot of situations where all I've needed is a pair of scissors in the car. So they're going in the basket too. Number 12, gum or mints. You always need something in the car. Gum might melt, so mints might be a good thing if they're going to keep it in the car. Number 13, hard candies. Now whether you like Werther's or you like those cinnamon discs, something that won't melt in the car would be a great idea. And number 14, the card. You can either get a card here for 50 cents to a dollar, or you can write a little note ex explaining your gift basket and why you bought those things for her. Now for the wrapping. You can get everything you need to wrap up your gift there. So I'm gonna get this cute little bow because my mom loves purple. Then I'm also gonna get this cellophane wrap to wrap everything up and put it together. All right guys, it's a new day. I have all my stuff, I'm ready to film. Busy mom on the go, Mother's Day gift basket. All right, I'm gonna take my container and start packing everything in. Now the trick to gift baskets is you wanna do the tallest things in the back and the shortest things in the front. Then with the rest of the stuff, you kind of just fill it in to wherever it will fit. Now my trick to cellophane wrapping is to use two little elastic rubber bands. So next I just measured out my cellophane and then I just pulled from all four corners and then with the elastic rubber bands, just put them right around the top of it. All right, now I'm just gonna add the purple bow. It came with two of them and I'm just gonna use one. So I wrap it all the way around and just tie it in a start of a knot. Then so it doesn't look like just a knot, I'll take one or two pieces and tie them separately so it kind of covers the middle so it looks like a little bow. And you are all done. The Dollar Tree has so many things that you could put gift baskets together with. Now if you go up there you can find that little dot. You can find my Dollar Tree kitchen must-haves. You could easily make a kitchen basket. It. There's also so many other things like teacher appreciation for us is coming up next week. Go and make 
a teacher appreciation basket. That would be so simple and easy. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I'm going to put a link in the description to Jen's gift basket. Be sure to check out her Dollar Tree Mother's Day ideas. All right, guys, see you later. Jen, no. <laughs>